the three floors at ground level. Proceed to the scene immediately. This is what we know so far. At uh, 8.30 this morning, an asteroid impacted the county of Granger. Our team on the ground are currently investigating the subject matter. If you can, shelter yourself. Catalina Sky Survey, this is Eric. I can't believe this. There's news here that an asteroid just hit in Texas. And it took out an entire town. I mean, it doesn't make any sense to me what you're talking about. Asteroids. An asteroid. An asteroid. David Morrison at Congress. Action. We have the means to protect our planet if we choose to do so. If we don't, we might go the way of the dinosaurs. Asteroids are definitely coming. There is one that's going to hit the Earth. It's, it's already set on that trajectory. We just don't know which one it is. So here's a tremendous catastrophe that can be prevented by humans working and observing and modeling and preparing. We actually came up with Deep Impact before the movie came up with their Deep Impact. And they got a lot of things right. Um, as but opposed... what did they get wrong? <laughs> Although it's very exciting to talk about a blowing up an asteroid or pushing it or moving it, yeah. what we need to do before we think about that is understand what's the threat. So who would be Oppenheimer? Who would be Oppenheimer? I don't know. I mean, I don't think anybody knew who Oppenheimer would be prior to the Manhattan Project either. You know, somebody would emerge. If we reject to do something, and as a consequence, millions of people die, history will not forget. We don't use phone anymore. I'm not going to go there. Is okay. that true? Of course it's true. Well, I wouldn't say it was not true. I can't do it. OK, I should. Because you know what would happen? Yes. We'd be dead. There's nothing to do at that point. Nothing evokes the end of the world more than a man running straight ahead on a beach, swathed in the sounds of his Walkman, cocooned in the solitary sacrifice of his energy, indifferent even to catastrophes, since he expects destruction to come only as the fruit of his own efforts from exhausting the energy of a body that has, in his own eyes, become useless. <laughs> 